Is NordVPN as amazing as it seems in reviews? In this video, I'm going to give you all of the details on one of the top rated VPNs for all things internet. But where to start? Well, let's start with a bad thing, shall we? One thing we don't really care for when it comes to NordVPN is that it sometimes has deals that it doesn't share on its homepage, which... Why would they do that? I don't know. So like the nerds we are, we geeked up a bot that checks all of its pages and automatically alerts us to new promotions. <laughs> the updated link is always in the description below, so you can bypass the homepage and get the best deals without having a dig. So put down that shovel. It's automatic, so if you choose to go with NordVPN, make sure you check out the link first. Now I'm going to fill you in why NordVPN consistently ranks at the top of the best VPN lists worldwide. Granted, it's a bit more expensive than most VPNs, but in my humble opinion, it's worth every penny. Plus, it comes with a 30-day money-back guarantee. So if you don't love it, or even if you simply don't want to tolerate it, you can get your money back. Or if you're like me, you'll just forget you signed up and pay them for a service you won't use for the next three years, because surely it's not just me who does that. So NordVPN is easy to install for mobile or desktops and supports Mac OS, Windows, Linux, iOS and Android, as well as several other devices, which is loads. Setup takes around two and a half to three minutes and the interface is really intuitive. To connect to a server, you simply click on either the speciality servers or all countries drop down menu on the left side of your screen and you choose your location. Then selecting settings is just as easy. Click to turn on notifications, enable custom DNS, start on boot, and more. You might think all VPNs would make life this easy, but trust me, the random guy on the internet you don't know, <laughs> it's always that way. Now I've seen some nightmare interfaces that practically require a degree to operate. I mean, who wants to mess with manually setting up protocols? Heaven forbid. If you do get stuck, NordVPN offers 24 live chat support too. And the rep I talked to was pleasant and helpful, which when it comes to support is rarer than a dodo on a pogo stick. They even sent a link to the exact device instructions needed. So those are the small details. For the rest of this review, I'm gonna focus on three main areas where NordVPN excels. Advanced security, total global access, privacy as a priority. Now don't worry, I'll cover the not so sunny side of NordVPN too. No reason to leave room for doubt, right? If you're in a hurry, you can try NordVPN right now by clicking on the link in the description below. Just don't forget to subscribe and set up notifications before you jet off. That way, you won't miss out on all the latest internet security and software news. So let's move on to advanced security next. NordVPN has all the standard VPN security features, including military-grade AES encryption for all of your cyber criminals out there, a kill switch for mobile and desktop, and several security protocols to choose from too. But what warms my geeky little heart is the innovative security features and newest protocols it offers. Actually, no, I think that might be heartburn. So, drummer, I pay to sit in the studio all the time. Can I get a drum roll, please? That's not a drum. Okay. On top of the standard VPN fare, you get double VPN, Nordlinks, and CyberSec. All right, settle down. A double VPN gives you a double layer of encryption. Now that's pretty impressive considering NordVPN already offers three layers of protection that includes AES 256-bit encryption, 2048-bit DH key, and SHA 384 authentication. All of the classics. It also supports perfect forward secrecy, which means you get a new encryption key each time that you log on. Now NordVPN offers standard secure protocols like OpenVPN, UDP TCP, and IKE V2 IPsec. But what sets it apart is Nordlinks. Nordlinks is NordVPN's proprietary WireGuard protocol and it's our go-to for buffer-free streaming and gaming. We'll stick with OpenVPN for torrenting though as the jury is still out on whether or not WireGuard protocols beat OpenVPN when it comes to security. But you're better safe than sorry, right? Let us know what you think about all of this in the comments below. On a side note, NordVPN doesn't offer PPTP though. I mean, it's vintage as far as protocols go, but someone out there might be clinging on to a classic, so it's worth a mention. To learn more about which protocols are best for what purposes, check out the link in the description below. We've got you covered. While you're in the general area, why don't you leave a like? 
please. I nearly forgot to say please there, sorry. Manners make of a man. So now that my desperate plea for acknowledgement is over, sorry about that, let's take a look at yet another level of NordVPN security, CyberSec. CyberSec is an ad and malware blocker on more steroids than 1980s Arnie. It blocks ads and even those annoying YouTube ads. DDoS attacks, pop-ups, and all the sneaky third-party software that tries to invade devices. I wonder if it would stop you two from forcing the whole world to download their album again. I'd pay top dollar for that level of peace of mind. So now, have a watch as I visit a sneaky little website. You'll see that without Nord, it automatically attempts to download unneeded third-party software to spy on my activity. Who oh, are you? Ugh. The good news is that as soon as I connected to NordVPN, it was instantly blocked. NordVPN also offers NordLocker to encrypt all your files before floating them up into the cloud. Now, I don't recommend you buy it up front, and it does offer three gigabytes of free data a month with a subscription, so there's really no need to. Plus, if you're enjoying using it and you need more space, you can up your data for a few extra dollars a month by clicking on the link in the description below. So what about total global access? Let's not forget that one. When I say total global access, I mean total global access. Websites, torrenting, news, streaming services, social media, VoIP, gaming. It's all available on a global scale with NordVPN. An entire world of entertainment and more at the click of a button. And before I forget, that includes China too, for all of you fans of the GoGo squad out there. Watch Netflix libraries worldwide, Amazon Prime Video, Hulu, Hotstar, YouTube, and more. It unblocks 40 plus streaming services, which is more content than you can watch in a lifetime. Now, plenty of VPNs say they can access Netflix, but it's more complex than you'd think. No VPN really works with all of Netflix. Its libraries are huge and they cover the globe. A VPN that works with Netflix US might not work with Netflix UK or Australia. Or maybe you want a specific movie, but it's only available in Canada. You'll end up pretty pissed off if your VPN can't unblock that Netflix library, right? We've tested NordVPN with Netflix libraries from all over the world, and other than a few hiccups with Netflix France, it gives you access to way more libraries than most other VPNs and helps you avoid the dreaded not available in your country or proxy error messages. The internet isn't limited to streaming though, so we wanted to see what else NordVPN gave us access to. Turns out it can unblock services like Zoom, WhatsApp, Facebook Messenger, and another popular meeting and messaging app. Google online banking services and other tools used every day often use VPN blocking technologies, so the fact that NordVPN lets you surf the web as if you aren't connected to a VPN at all is incredible. NordVPN lets you post all the filtered selfies, fun adventures, and culinary dishes you want. It works for Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram, no matter where you travel. But how does it kick so much geo-blocking booty? Well, it has a smart play feature that offers maximum security while it goes to work bypassing geo restrictions using both DNS and VPN technologies, but I'm sure that was obvious to someone intelligent like yourself. The blazing fast speeds, unlimited bandwidth and data, and the ability to pick from any of NordVPN's thousands of servers across 60 countries make lag, congestion, and buffering a thing of the past. We did notice speeds were a bit slower on the Malaysia and Vietnam servers, but not enough to raise a real alarm. It's also important to remember that the recommended server isn't always the fastest, so don't be afraid to scale the mountain of available servers to another location. Now, we won't bore you with all the data from the speed tests, but I will say our site has covered the VPN industry for the last four years, and NordVPN ranked number one for speed in 2020 after improving its technology. The three years before that, it ranked number four. Over the last few months, we've consistently tested it, and it proves itself to be faster than any other VPN. For us, this is one of the most important features a VPN can have. Now let's look at privacy as a priority. And that animal noise that I've been working on for years signifies the elephant in the room. <laughs> I mean, come on, that's not bad, is it? Sounds pretty convincing. Check this out. If I move my head at the same time, it sounds like an F1 car or just an elephant running really fast. <laughs> Review video? I guess that doesn't translate as well to videos. Anyway, I'm sure you've heard about the 2019 NordVPN security breach. If you haven't, well, where have you been? <laughs> Truth is, 
It only proved how concrete this VPN's no-log policy really is. NordVPN's main headquarters is in Panama, which is where all the totally legit companies are based outside the 5, 9 and 14 Eyes alliances. Panama doesn't have any invasive data collection regulations either, which is handy. So what happened? Well, Nord got a notification about a server breach. The VPN community went bananas. Of course, they expected a VPN to be secure, so this shouldn't have happened. But after all the drama, it turned out the server wasn't even Nord's. Competitors simply fueled the drama to try and attack an industry leader in VPNs in an attempt to discredit them. So Nord hired a few experts to check their servers and technology and were completely transparent with the reports. We actually read them and they took the situation really seriously. And like Obi-Wan, when struck down, it only made them stronger and built user trust. Need more proof? Check out the graph on Google Trends in the link below. You'll see how Nord bounced back and landed on top. <sighs> oh, phew, I've got that out of the way. The elephant has left the room. Bye-bye, Nelly. <coughs> Go on. NordVPN is a torrenter's dream. Imagine it, dedicated onion over Tor servers. The ability to securely and anonymously access uTorrent, BitTorrent, and ViewZ from anywhere. Beautiful. Just to be clear, I would hope you use it legally and don't take advantage of the fact that Nord won't check or log your location. Have you ever had one of those naked in a crowd dreams? A kill switch is the equivalent to someone handing you a trench coat, cool shades, and saying, we got this. Just like that, you're completely covered. Wait, that wasn't a dream. A kill switch blocks outbound traffic if the server gets disconnected, helping to prevent potentially harmful DNS and IP leaks. NordVPN offers a kill switch for mobile and desktop, and it's on by default on the mobile app, but you'll need to turn it on manually for desktop. NordVPN doesn't offer split tunneling for desktop, but it is available on mobile. Split tunneling can help you increase your speeds during streaming and torrenting by allowing you to channel specific apps through the VPN. Now, if you want to increase your speeds while using a VPN for desktop, we can help. No Express VPN, another one of our top VPNs, does offer split tunneling for desktop. The one thing we used to really be critical about was NordVPN's use of HDD for temporary file storage. Thankfully, NordVPN has switched to RAM for temporary file storage. A nice plus, as it means these files no longer have to be deleted manually. The move helps eliminate the chance for any data, no matter how small, to be leaked or accessible to hackers. This isn't a massively surprising move. ExpressVPN did the same thing a few months before they did, and you know Nord wasn't gonna fall behind. Regardless of who does it first, these top providers will always be at each other's heels. After all, they are fierce competitors, which means the products will only get better. It's fast, secure, and offers limitless, anonymous access to everything on the web. NordVPN may not always post its best deals on its website, but of course, we've got you covered. Before you shuffle on, you can check out the newest, most exclusive NordVPN deals using this link. Like I said, we have a bot that updates it daily. Check it out. That is, of course, if you are human. As always, if you dig what we do, can you show me some love by clicking like or subscribing to our channel? <laughs>